there guys, Mike here again. Thanks for clicking this video. As some of you might know, I like to collect Hot Wheels, race Hot Wheels, and of course make the Hot Wheels timing system. So please have a look at that playlist. I work in an engineering office and I thought it'd be a great idea to boost office morale to have a lunch hour Hot Wheels tournament. And I'll show you what I did. So I brought my Hot Wheels racetrack system into the office here and at lunch hour, we're gonna host a tournament. So this is a two lane scaled quarter mile track with a timing system. So this is a, a precise starting gate and it has a micro switch on the bottom. And when you set it off, it starts a timer and the cars come all the way down here and go through the timing gate. So this timing gate is very interesting. It has a speed trap. So the front set of beams there are the speed trap beams. And then it has the finish line. And when the cars finish, it actually gives you a ET and a speed in miles an hour. And then we have our stop gate box there. So now you know how the system all works out. We'll go ahead and we'll give it a shot and I'll show you how it all operates. So the cars are ready to go. We pull back the lever. And we see that lane one one with the flashing LED light and that car ran a 1.867 second and a 9.70 miles an hour. So what I did last week, I told everybody that we're gonna have a tournament at lunch hour and you need to submit a car and no two cars can be duplicate. And I put all their names on a tournament bracket and we're gonna whittle down to the winner. For lane choice, you get to pick. I brought a bag in with some poker chips. And what you do is before every race, you reach in and if you grab a green, then you have lane choice and you have a red, well, that's tough luck. If two greens are being pulled at the same time, then you reach in again and keep on grabbing until somebody only picks a green. So for whatever reason, one lane's always faster than the other, so people have to pay attention during the race here to figure out what lane they should be in. The Ford F-150 actually had the fastest speed overall at 10.86 miles an hour. And the funny car here got the fastest ET and the overall winner as well. A lot of this has to do with weight. So if you look at the weight here, this actually weighed 73 grams and the Ford pickup truck weighed 44 grams, which is also for a mainline, a pretty heavy modern Hot Wheel. So here is the completed bracket. 22 cars were entered. All I did was found this online and printed it out and put it on the wall and we just filled it out as we go. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. All my coworkers really had a fun time during lunch hour here. I do have a playlist of all my Hot Wheels stuff and I'll put a link in the description below of all the timing system and how it all works. Once again, thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.